Hello everyone, this is Muhammad Sami and you are watching the series of eAcademe from the platform of CA Educationist. In this video, I will be sharing some strategies that you can adopt to improve your credit score. Credit score is considered as one of the key indicators while evaluating the financial position of any borrower. In simple terms, it is a number which reflects your credit worthiness. The higher your score is, the more credit worthy you are considered in the eyes of the lenders because it tells about how good you are in managing your debt. A better credit score elevates the confidence of the lender while considering the possibility of extending further loan to any borrower. These scores are calculated based on your payment history, the length of your credit history, your credit mix, amount you owe and the new credit applied. It is important for any person or business to keep all these factors in check to maintain good credit score. Since bad credit score can be detrimental for your business operations, it becomes vital to discuss if there are any ways to improve these scores. Some people often limit improving the scores to credit repairing which involves removing or correcting negative information on a credit report. But there are several other strategies that you can adopt to improve the credit score of your business. Before discussing those strategies, let us get ourselves familiar with two important terminologies. Credit report. It is a statement that shows information about your credit activity and current credit situation such as loan repayment history and the status of your credit accounts. Credit reporting agency. Credit reporting agencies, also known as credit reporting bureaus, are the business entities that maintain historical credit information on individuals and businesses. They receive reports from lenders and various other sources and compile them into a credit report that includes a credit score when issued. Let us now discuss the strategies. The first and foremost step is to get the credit reports of your business from at least two to three agencies to identify the problems causing bad credit score. You need to go through all relevant details of the business on the reports and make sure that all information is accurate as errors can cause misreporting which can impact your credit score. The next step is to check all the accounts on credit history which are negatively affecting the credit score to identify the problems and also to highlight any error or misreporting. If any error is identified, it can be disputed with the reporting agency by providing relevant evidence. You might be able to improve the score by getting erroneous negative feedback removed from your report. Number three. Getting a business credit card is one of the easiest ways to build your credit score. You can get multiple cards and use these revolving lines while making payments on behalf of the business rather than using your personal credit card as it will help build credit history for your business. Number 4. While using business credit card and other available credit lines, a critical factor to remember is to keep credit utilization ratio lower. A higher utilization ratio can negatively impact your credit score. You can reduce utilization rate by making payment of balance amount, transferring credit from one credit line to another, getting new lines of credit and decreasing credit card spending. Another factor that improves your credit score is having a good mix of credit lines available to your business. It helps to build a diversified credit history for the business with good payment records. You should also refrain from closing off accounts that are not in use as keeping those accounts provides more diversity and keeps utilization ratio down. Another step that can be taken to improve credit score is establishing credit accounts with your suppliers. Having a good history with a credit supplier reflects positively on your overall credit score. If you are working with some suppliers for a long time, try and negotiate credit terms with them. 
It is also important to get positive payment experiences added to your file from vendors and suppliers that are not registered with credit reporting agencies. You can get these experiences added to your credit history manually through the credit reporting agency. Number seven, it is very important to get the negative feedbacks and overdue balances removed from your history. Even if you pay out an overdue amount, it will still reflect on your credit history as negative account. However, you can negotiate a pay for delete settlement with the creditor and ask them to agree a payment schedule for their due amount. Through this, you can get the negative account removed from your history and get the creditor settled. Number eight, you should also be careful in applying for new loans or credit lines as it raises a hard inquiry on your report. Hard inquiry is raised when a potential lender checks your credit score for evaluation of requested loan. Hard inquiries put a negative impact on your credit score and the impact lasts for 12 months but the inquiry in itself stays on the history for 24 months. You can get hard inquiries removed from your score only if they are not legitimate. And in that case, you have to raise a dispute or contact the lender who raised the inquiry and ask them to remove it. Lastly, you should always try and pay your bills and loans on time because there is nothing better than having a positive payment history and clean debt settlements on your credit history. Thank you for watching the video. For more videos, keep watching the series of eAcademe from the platform of CA Educationist by Muhammad Sami. For any queries, you may WhatsApp or email at the given contact details.